Right now, he's facing six attempted murder charges. Way 31's Alex Torres Perez joins us live from the Lauderdale County Sheriff's Office. She spoke to neighbors in the area of the attack. Alex. The North Florence community is obviously shocked after what happened today, especially after hearing that three children were attacked with a machete. I just couldn't imagine that uh, anything that tragic had happened right here under my nose. Willie Brannon has lived off Lauderdale County Road 57 for 20 years now. He says the area is usually quiet. That's why he, along with others, were shocked to hear a man attack his own family. Well, I was just shocked. I mean, that's just what you see on TV, you know, fiction. That's a person who lived next door to the scene said the suspect had recently moved in. They were just your average family. They, I mean, I seen them play, seen the uh, adults come, come and go, never heard any arguments, never heard them have a bad day. Neighbors say they just can't believe a man attacked his own children and brother with a machete. That is crazy. Like, I don't have the, the words for that. Like, I, it had to be somebody out of their mind. And hope they're all able to make a full recovery. Just hope nothing like this ever happened again. At this time, we do not know the current condition of those three kids or the adult. The Lauderdale County Sheriff says he is working to get that update. This morning, he did say that they were from anywhere from serious to critical condition, and he hopes they all pull through. Reporting live in Florence, Alex Torres Perez, Way 31 News. Sealy cannot bond out because he was on probation. We will bring you more updates as this story develops.